Hey, what is going on guys? Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I will be unboxing the Call of Duty Modern Warfare PlayStation Pro. So as you guys can see, this PlayStation is exclusive as it says on here, and it is the one terabyte PlayStation Pro. This PlayStation Pro is also in the color jet black and is in 4K. So as you guys can see over here, this is what the bundle includes. It includes obviously the PlayStation 4 Pro console, the Dual Shock 4 wireless controller, the Call of Duty Modern Warfare Blu-ray disc, the mono headset, the HDMI cable, an AC power cord, a USB cable, and a printed material. This PlayStation also has the Modern Warfare Special Ops Survival Mode because I got the PlayStation Pro that was included for the Modern Warfare PlayStation. Also, as you guys can see, this PlayStation also has a Special Ops Survival Mode because I got the exclusive PlayStation Pro with the Modern Warfare disc. So now without further ado, let's go ahead and unbox this PlayStation. Let's go ahead and take this out of its box. I'm gonna be totally honest, I did not think that this was the cover. I thought this was what the PlayStation was in with styrofoam, but I guess not. So now let's go ahead and unbox the actual PlayStation Pro. Oh crap. Let's go ahead and pull out the PlayStation. And then there is the Modern Warfare CD. That's all that was in the box. Let's go ahead, put the PlayStation aside, and let's open this Modern Warfare CD. So I think the only Call of Duty um, Modern Warfare that has the Special Ops Survival Mode is if you get the PlayStation Exclusive Mode. So if you get the PlayStation, you get this, but if you don't, I don't think you can get this any other way. So I'm glad I got this PlayStation. And obviously you need internet to be able to play the game. So let's go ahead and open this CD. So let's go ahead and open the CD up. So here is the CD. And there you go. So let's go ahead and put this aside and see what else comes with the PlayStation. So cables come with it, the controller, and the earbuds. Holy, so it's in like different languages and it's like a study guide. And then what is this? Are these all the instructions and information? Wow, that is a lot of information. That is a lot. I'm guessing it's like safety procedures and all that stuff, so then again, it's okay. So, and then this would be a quick guide start if you've never had a PlayStation before or you just don't know how to control it. And that's it, but I'm not seeing any like survival ops special mode on there. So I'm assuming when you get on, it'll somehow connect. I don't know, but anyways. Um, now we are going to open the controller. So this is what the controller looks like. I actually have a PlayStation myself, but I decided to get the Pro. Since the PlayStation Pro is 4K and I can connect it to a 4K TV, which will be amazing. Now let's go ahead and open all the cables, headphones, and all that stuff. So this is what the headphone looks like. This earbud is actually not that bad. Like I used to use this a lot before and it was pretty good. So I'll definitely be using this again. I just lost the other ones and I can find them. So finally I have new ones and I can use them again. Next is the cable to turn on your PlayStation. So this is the power cable. Moving on. Then we have the HDMI cable. And it looks like this. 
And finally, we have the cable that you can charge your controller with. I think this is a micro USB, but I'm not sure. Now that we're done with all that, let's go ahead and open up the PlayStation itself. Oh, this is upside down. Whoa! No, it's not! What? Wait, is it? Yeah, it is. Wait, this isn't upside down. Yes, it is. No, it's not. Yes, it is. Oh. Well, I guess the bottom of the PlayStation has, like, the controls, like, on the, um, the controller. Um, so it has the square, the triangle, the circle, and the X. And it has the PlayStation logo. So let's go ahead and flip this over. So in the front, it says PlayStation, and there are two USB ports. Usually, I just connect my charging cable to this to charge my controller, and sometimes, if I really need to, I charge my phone with it as well. But now, moving to the back. So the first thing that I see is the power port. Then there is the HDMI out port. Then there is the aux, the digital output. Then there is another USB port. And then there is an internet port. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more videos. Make sure to check out my brother's channel right down in the description below. And I'll see you guys in another one. Bye, guys.